Hi, I have in my hand a freestanding oscillating fan. Uh, it's a 16 inch fan. Um, it's available with low cost um, delivery directly from freetv.ie. So come to this outer box here, this is how you get it. I have done a little bit of assembly work on it, which I'm going to disassemble in a few moments just to show you exactly what's um, involved in the overall assembly process. Um, so basically, if we look here, we'll see that um, we have um, three different speed settings basically off and speed one, two, and three. Um, and we have a guard here we could put on the front. I'm just not going to do that because it's just to make this assembly a bit more awkward. Um, you can see basically we have clamps here. You can just clamp it all the way around. So you push it up and then you just push down the clamps and it locks the front and back together. These are stiff when you push them down deliberately because they want it to be stiff when you're pushing them down and stiff when the strength break free. Uh, you can have a little a tiny screw here as well uh, with a nut on it, so a bolt and nut and it matches with this little, tiny little hole here and it just means you can physically lock it into position on these ones here as well. Um, so what I'll do here at this point is I'm just going to move this power unit forward. I haven't fully tightened these. We only have put two screws in the base rather than the forward I can with it in order to be tightened them fully. So I'll just push this in here now. So this stay off position and now I'll come along and put it in speed one. Speed two, so you can see it's oscillating here. Uh, speed two and speed three here. Let's go on a little faster. Okay, so um, I'm just going to stop it here now, and that's just it. So what I'm going to do at this point now is maybe disassemble this and just show you what's exactly what's involved in it. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to unplug it. The next thing here is I'm just going to take the top section off of here. So if we just look on the back here, there's a little locking nut here. So I can just unscrew this here. And that's just locking into a shaft that's in the center here. So we'll come along here and we'll go. Now when you go to put the tread on here, it's actually the opposite of what you'd normally have when you go to lock it. And the reason of course that is that um, it had an ordinary direction when the fan is spinning, it'll actually be loosening the nut and you want it to be tightening obviously as it spins. So if you just come along here then, you just put the blade directly off here. And this is the reverse of how I assembled it to show it. I just wanted to start the video to have it assembled. And that's the base that went on. So you just be on the opposite of that all the way back. Um, now I'll just put this directly on here. So this is how it arrives, where you just have this treaded section that sits directly in here. And you just unscrew that, screw it back in. Um, so then we come along here. It's just a plastic cover here. It's only for aesthetic reasons. I'm just going to remove this. We can't do it. Just one second here. because We just have to remove this section here. This is sort of a telescopic pole on the bottom. So it's actually a good bit of adjustment on this. You can have it up this high or down this low. Okay, so that's the adjustment on it. And if I come along here, I'm just going to undo the first and then the second screw here. And, uh, oops, my goodness, me. So we can see here, this is the base, and then this base is here. So when the pack arrives, there's two base things. You slot them in together like that. You put this on top, you put the four screws in, you lock it in, you drop this mechanism over on it. And this little shaft here comes initially just inside the main shaft. And the only thing I did was I just used a screwdriver just to line it up so I could pull this directly in. And there's a little stop on the end of the bar to stop it pulling any higher. And when this locking mechanism locks in, it just locks the bar into whatever height you set it at. So um, we have different versions of uh, oscillating fans. With desk mounted ones, probably the most popular. These ones wouldn't be too far behind. People just have it there. You can have it standing um, on a floor or you could have it coming along and um, you could have it coming along um, on top of a bench area, something like that as well, I suppose. Uh, would be a possibility with it. Probably on the ground is better. Um, it's a reasonably stable overall structure. Um, I sort of like these fans. The price point on them, I thought would be far more expensive. Um, really, in terms of sales and things like this, we're completely dependent on the weather. We don't sell any in the winter time. They sell reasonably well in fairly hot summers and extremely well in extremely hot summers, okay? Um, so that's it anyway. This, uh, the 16-inch stand fan available with low-cost shipping from freetv.ie.